A lot of tips sounds back. I know, right? That was so lame. There were so many tips during that period as well. You guys are really cool, you know that. People were still tipping. Even when it wasn't updating properly. Even when I couldn't read them. Even when it wasn't making the sounds or the impressive system for top tips wasn't working. Very cool, fellas. Very cool. Very fucking cool. Like I said, cheers, dudes. Also talk to Otacon, indeed. If you missed the damn codex, you'll have a lesser learning experience than um, Metal Gear Rising in the future. Looking forward to Metal Gear Rising at some point. Looking forward to that. Thank you very much, Alpha. And as um, over the tip said as well, we will indeed be checking the codex screen a bit more frequently. I mean, it was really critical in Metal Gear Solid 3, but not so much in this. But still extra stories to fly. I apologise, I've missed out little bits and bobs here and there. And DRG was saying to... Pull the camera up above Snake's head and wait for a few seconds. And somebody else said about the, um, the face camo for Old Snake. It was Blood Reaper. So we've got a few things to do there, a few things to do. Thank you very much, dudes. Like I said, very, very cool and very kind of you. Very, very kind. Like I said, people tipping when it wasn't even making the sound. It's like, we don't give a fuck. We don't give a fuck, we're going to tip anywhere. Like I said, my apologies, dudes, for the, um... For the, for the problems there and stuff like that, it was not of my making. It was not by my hand that tips were not given flesh or whatever the fucking quote. Oh, I can't believe it. I just completely fucked up the Castlevania quote there. It was not by my hand that I was given flesh. Uh, so, once, again, given once again, given. Fucking hell, Claire knows the Castlevania quote. My memory. Oh, no. Yeah, Claire's memory is even worse than mine. But to be fair, though, you've actually played a lot of Castlevania. The, 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 not the original ones, but. <laughs> But the Symphony of the Night and Above ones, you've actually played them a few times, haven't you? So, Claire's actually... Co <laughs> no, you play, you play Portrait Ruin a couple of times, you played Castle of, uh, Symphony of the Night a couple of times, you played Order of Ecclesia, kind of. Pardon? Kind of. Kind of. Dude, piss out of me, you daughter player. <laughs> No, I was saying I, did, 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 I don't remember stuttering, but I guess I'll go along with it. Uh, I assume I stuttered, you know, but I, I don't know. But like I say, you, know, you do realise that, you know, we're, we're on different sides of the camp now. You know, me playing CS all the time lately, and then you're fucking playing Dota. There can only be one toxic community. I wonder what happens when, like... If there's a game that comes out and all the Dota players play it and all the Counter-Strike players play it, I wonder what would fucking happen. It's like the immovable object of toxic community versus the fucking unstoppable force of toxic communities. Like, I wonder what would happen. It would just be like... The whole world would implode. Amazing. Le bad. <laughs> <laughs> you know? I can't even imagine. I can't even imagine. Right, dudes, like I say, thank you very much, guys. Thank you very much. Put the snake, uh, put the camera over Snake's head for a few seconds and let's see what happens. I don't know what's happening there, dude. No, I, I can't, I, it doesn't seem to be doing anything. Oh, well. I was almost expecting it to go into like, a oh, brup, brup, brup. Thank you very much, Solar Flirt. Here's a tip to help support Claire's daughter addiction. <laughs> I, I don't think she's, I don't think she's quite addicted again so much at the moment, are you? But she's, she's playing it again a little bit, yeah. But I was expecting the, oh, thank you very much, Solar Flirt. Very kind, sir, very kind. I'm glad to see the, um, the system is indeed still working. Good, good shit, good shit. Seems like we've got it now, we've got it. Must have been some conflict with previously installed versions. Um, I was always expecting it to go into kind of like an overhead kind of like, you know, like Metal Gear Solid 1 camera if you stuck there long enough. Or maybe we need to combine the overhead camera thing with the face camouflage. Um, young with bandana. Metal Gear Solid 1 Snake. Maybe that's what you need. Fuck me. It's just like how he wore. He has no eyes again. 
He has no fucking eyes again. No, I didn't expect it to look identical. So that's what an HD version of Metal Gear Solid 1 would look like. Or at least, you know, like, if you're using... The <laughs> Very HD. It's it, HD as fuck. Still more detailed than Minecraft. <laughs> so I wonder. Oh, can we change this? Should we change this chest color? What should we have? Oh, I think a grey one. I think a grey one. Seems as though around in snow and stuff like that. I think a grey one would do. Right then, so let's put it over Snake's head for a bit. See what happens if if anything does happen. No. No. Doesn't seem to do anything there. Not sure. And the codec. Let us speak to Otacon and Rosemary as well. But Otacon first. Hey Snake, something I've been meaning to ask you. That canyon, isn't that where you demolished Raven's tank? How'd you do it anyway? How? Uh, well, grenades. That's it? You didn't use an anti-tank missile or something? Didn't have one. Your technique is kind of, well, how do I put this, archaic when it comes to fighting tanks. Honestly, I don't think it'd work on today's main battle tanks. Well, that's how I did it. What do you want me to say? You know, I asked an active duty army officer once, if an infantryman had to take on a tank one-on-one, -on -one, how should he do it? And what was his answer? Don't. He swore there's no way in hell a single infantryman could take down a tank by himself. Huh. Interesting. I always suspected there was a little something crazy about you, Snake. But hearing that story, now I know it. You're nuts! Single-handedly taking out a tank? That's crazy! You're insane! Otacon, is this your idea of a compliment? <laughs> yes! You're the toughest, craziest, most hardcore badass on the planet. You're the shit. As if, as if Alcon says you're the shit. Oh, hi, Snake. Rose. Your psych is in excellent condition. Everything looks good to go. Great, thanks. Snake, the gauge below your life gauge is your psych gauge. There we yeah. go. About you time. Tell me about that. Then you'll hear it again. The psych gauge affects the rate at which your life gauge recovers. In other words, how fast your wounds heal. It also greatly Fucking influences how well you shake perform that. various actions. When your psych gauge is full, your life recovers quickly and you shouldn't have any problems doing what you need to do. Remember, your body isn't the only thing driving your performance. Your mind is every bit as important. Hey. I don't let my mental state affect my combat efficiency. You may think that, Snake, but the truth is, you're... you're not as young as you used to be. Hmm. <laughs> Could've fooled me. It's your psych that's keeping you alive inside. So you better take it seriously. Keep a close eye on your psych gauge. Alright, alright. <laughs> I think I caught a glimpse of somebody saying, um... The thing only works out, you have to, you've got to go back out or something like that to get... Wh whatever it is with putting the camera over Snake's head. Like, say, sorry, dude. Oh my god! This is probably not the best place to try this. I'm so fucking scared. I think I saw somebody saying go back out if you wanted to do this thing, but... It's gonna be dangerous! I'm sorry, dude. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm going. I'm going. I'm going. I'm going. Fuck. It seems like it didn't work. You had to be in an earlier park. So, I mean, the camera's above Zed for a bit there. 
But it seems like you've got to be in a part. I mean, I lost the stream chat, so what would what would it have done? Oh wait, you have to use it at the helipad OTG. Ah, oh, Damn, what would it have done? Would it have made it like Metal Gear Solid 1 kind of viewpoint? Sorry, sorry dude. Somebody tipped me over there saying do that, but... Wait a minute, what? Ah, oh, okay. Like I said, sorry dude, it seems like I was a little bit too late in getting to the, um... Get into the tip for the right bit to do that, but only if it admit it Metal Gear Solid 1 kind of view. But then again, we did have some Metal Gear Solid 1 kind of view bits. But it'd, it'd be nice to see. Rat. It'd be nice to have seen that. <laughs> State of him. Ring, ring. I don't see any enemies around here. Okay, we'll go through the door all the way at the back. Otacon, last time around we had a few complications and wound up going through the commander's office in the basement. That's right. I remember now. But there's no need to go all the way down there this time, right? <laughs> the back door takes us straight where we need to go. Mm -hmm. Good point. Okay then, let's get to the back door. To the back door. Should I use um, this snake? Or should I use an updated version of what would be young snake? Young with bandana. Oh, there we go. Fucking hell. Look at the difference. Metal Gear Solid 1. How he looked in the game. And how he should have looked in the game. <laughs> Fuck it out. <laughs> Holy shit. I don't, I don't, it's, it's fair enough, it's fair enough, you know. Leave the PlayStation 1 alone. But still. I guess we gotta go to one of these. We did a weird squeaking sound. Elevator? Oh, oh, wait, yeah, I was right. Fucking hell. I'm just surprised, you know. What? What? Otacon, the elevator's not working. Hmm. The panel lights are dead, too. Looks like the power's out. Still, there's no need to take the elevator, is there? Hurry up and head to the gate at the north end of the building. What get? Oh, that get. Oh, didn't see that. Huh? Snake, that door is locked. How do I open it? Security is shut down altogether. You can't release the lock without activating it. You'll have to log in somewhere. I've got it, Snake. My old office is close by. With the power on, you should be able to unlock the door from there. And if you check the facility records, we can find out Rex's status and who's been in and out. You remember where it is, Snake? Uh, I'm not senile yet. Just to be safe, I'm marking it on your map. You old geezer. <coughs> Snake, the password is 48273. 48273. You remember that? I told you, I'm not senile. I'm yeah. gonna fucking forget it by the time I get there. 48273. So, uh, Snake, I've checked the APU on this floor and engaged the generator. Energy output is low, but it should be enough to power the elevator. Do that before! Try the elevator and see if it's working. But it does. Why not come? It tells you shit like afterwards. Does stuff for you afterwards. What? Oh. Elevator's not been used in a while.
Rip! Thank you very okay. much, Max Maximilian. First, go down the central hallway. Don't worry, it's not electrified anymore. Oh, I remember this shit. Thank you very much, Max Maximilian. Very kind, sir. Very kind. Welcome. Well, not welcome to the streamer. All I've, I've seen. Max has been around many times. What the fuck? What's going on? Oh, it's a flashback of Grey Fox, isn't it? That Max has been around plenty of times before. As well, welcome to the um, the sub, the sub crew. Thank you very much, dude. Sub hype. I'm sneaking for there's nobody here. I love the marks. Fucking awesome. I had a black cat before, or is it silver? I can't remember. Now I've got a fucking orange Hold on. I want to check security. robot cat. We a chicken kind of like wing, but whatever. I can have a chicken robot cat if you want me. I want a chicken robot cat in. They're cute as fuck. You'd want one. They're, they're cute. Look at his cute. Look at him dancing. Oh, you missed it. He's dancing up and down then. He's probably there now. Oh, look at He's looking after snake, kind of. Snake. Are you okay? Cute as like dance around and shit, pop up and down. Snake, that password I told you before. Four eight two seven three. <laughs> Can you punch it in for me? Is he being a sarcastic bastard or well, not sarcastic, but you know, taking the it's piss? A five digit number. Four, eight, two, seven, three. That's one of the best. Like, I'm. I'm sorry. I know. I like swoon. Over Metal Gear Solid 4 all the fucking time, like, but everything's really nice. That's like a really nice password input kind of screen. Actually, it looks like it's on the monitor kind of thing. That's, that's nice. Yeah. Me and you, old snake, we got this. Oh, Otacon forgot. Everybody thought I'd forget, but no. Nice job. At least your memory hasn't gone bad. <laughs> that DOS. I say it's cool being back in men, um main thing for the first game. Work. All nicely updated and everything. This is the room where we first met, huh? <laughs> this is the room where I first pissed my pants, huh? Oh shit! Oh, he flashed back. I saw that fucking screenshot though, man. When he was on the phone, he pissed his pants. Memories, is it? What about you? I can't believe Snake resisted the temptation to say, well, what about you pissing your pants? That unpleasant memory? Yeah, I remember. If you hadn't shown up when you did, uh, gives me the shivers just thinking about it. Snake? You saved my life. Naomi hated them for what they did to Frank's body. But it was me that crippled him in the first place. 
She must have hated me too. <sighs> we shouldn't have been so trusting. I blame myself too. I helped develop Rex. That's why it was so easy for me to believe her feelings were genuine. But she was only using us to atone for her sins. So what? What did she do to us? You forgot already? She betrayed you. She stole your blood. If that was all, it should have been over and done with in South America. Why'd she join us afterward? Well, I... I you know. She has us come rescue her, and then she turns around and goes straight back to Liquid. Why would she do that? I don't know, Snake. But it looks like she's still with him. What? I just had a look at the security access logs. As I thought, there's people coming and going at frequent intervals. In fact, the records show some recent activity. Look at this. It's an image taken a few hours ago by a surveillance camera up ahead. It acts like a cat. Like, what are you doing looking at me first? Like, no, I, I wanna, I'm going to look somewhere else. I don't know what you want. Naomi. And Vamp. The Beauty and the Beast. They've been through here. From what we've gleaned from the security records, it can only mean one thing. They're headed for Rex's old underground hangar. I finished rebooting security and released the locks. The door on the first floor ought to open for you now. Uh, uh, amazing. Almost makes me nostalgic for the days when you needed a key card for every door. <laughs> yep. It's been nine years. All you really have to do is reinterpret the old technology in terms of the new. Getting old isn't all that bad, you know. <laughs> Let's get going, Snake. I finished unlocking the door on the first floor. It should open now. I've been waiting for you, Snake. Who are you? Neither enemy nor friend. Gray Fox. Colonel, that ninja is Gray Fox. Ridiculous. You yourself in Zanzibar Land. Yes, yes. He should have been killed, but he's still alive. What? What? They were using a soldier for their gene therapy experiments. How long are you going to stay in there? Are you one of them? Hey, what the fuck? Gecko! We've got Gecko! Fucking hell! In here! Um... No! That doesn't count, that shit at all! I thought there was a locker or something. No, that does not count. Can't even follow me? Definite non countage over there. He can't even move it, it just fucking block the. No. How am I supposed to get past that motherfucker? I'm gonna kill it. It took a cow piss! Robots don't piss! I'm gonna fucking RPG this son of a bitch. Impressive! Thank you very much, dude! I'll wait to just um, shoot this Metal Gear in the Rex. What the fuck? In the Rex? Okay, that'll do. RIP! That was the... Uh, wasn't sure if that was the sub or the, um, the thing said it saw me. In the neck? Where's the neck? I forced me, Respond. What? Snake. Old school. 
why can't it be more descriptive or an easier area to shoot? Shoot it in the neck. It's a fucking robot. It doesn't I really have the average kind the of neck. On the first floor. It should open now. I need to figure out how to kill these motherfuckers. What's up the little circles? Weak points? Snake, it's blocking the hallway leading to the elevator. You'll have to do something before you can get to the first floor. Green rash. Why I must feel bad with my sound is mechan. Feel kind of bad. Oh, it's getting up, fuck him. I feel kind of bad when it's standing on it. No! I wanted that, I wanted that good at I'm getting that good at Nah, 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 nah. Fucking dick, eh? What did it do? See, I was. What, 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 Arcon? What? Remember when we first met? I hate to bring up painful memories, but remember how you got shocked in this hallway before you first came to my office? Yeah. Blew me halfway across the room. Come to think of it, why have a high voltage current running through the floor in a research facility? Isn't that dangerous? Well, it wasn't there at first, obviously. They installed it when Liquid took the place over. To keep you from escaping. So you'd have to finish Rex. Exactly. Say, didn't you destroy the switchboard to the current? With a remote control missile. Yeah. Oh my god, well, not I just that. <laughs> it out over the land, and it looks like those the Nikita are incident. Still getting power. What? That would mean. Maybe you can use the Mark III to turn the current in the floor on again. The Gecko probably have decent surge protection on their electronic components, but a good long high voltage bath just might fry their organic parts. Go ahead and send the Mark III over to the switchboard. It's worth a shot. Yeah, 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 okay, cool. Probably isn't the... Hey, yo! Is it got a PlayStation pad? I've never noticed that. It's a PlayStation 3 pad. I've never seen that in his hands before. I'm controlling a character, controlling a character. Visible? Catrick kicked my little Mark III, leave me alone. Oh, shoot it now, no. No, get away from me. There, Snake. To turn on the current in the floor, press the action button in front of the switch. Oh! Is any button but that, dude? Action button. Oh, I just knocked on glass. There's a little, there's a little robot cat now. It, it's kind of like a. It is when it chases, it's like a fucking T Rex. Sounds like a cow, though. I think we can't hear it. They press the action button near the fucking thing.
I'm pressing. What is it? What move? 